For much of the day, residents of this quiet street came home to this. Portions of Pomeroy Drive blocked off as the death of one of their neighbors was investigated. I mean, I was really shocked, honestly, you know, uh, something like this happening in our neighborhood, you know. Ali Sial was at work when he found out something was happening on Pomeroy Drive, where he lives. I was, you know, still kind of worried about my parents, you know, making sure that they were okay. That was my big concern. His parents were okay, but he found out his neighbor had been killed. Police say the victim was found dead in his own home with obvious signs of foul play. He was a great neighbor. Uh, we never really had any problems. Many neighbors say he frequently walked from his home to nearby stores. He would walk up and uh, down the street um, every other day or so. I would see him and he would always wave and stop and talk. Police cars and detectives are not something they are used to on this street. It's scary, very scary, very, very scary. And I'm very sad for him. The man remembered as a helpful carpenter who did work for many neighbors. He was a great dude, always jolly, you know. Uh, Whenever he greeted me, he, you know, there was a way he uh, called my name. That was kind of uh, funny. I like that. Uh, and it, I'll miss him you know, as a person. You know, he was a great person. Mark Vanderhoff, WLKY News.